but uh, we're about to shave her head. And the reason we are shaving her and Terry and Hope's head is because they have chosen to do this extreme action of preparation so that we lessen our water uses when we first get up there. Because when we first get up there, we are not going to have any flowing water source, no well, no nothing. We're going to be piping in water and it takes a lot of water to wash human hair, especially female long hair. And so we're going to, they're, they're letting me get away without shaving my head because hair because it will never grow back because I'm, you know, going bald. But these two are actually shaving their head now. Okay, let's see if we can do this. So people, if you only had eight days left, what extreme action would you make? What extreme sacrifice would you have to give up to go live off the grid with no water, no power, nothing like that? Would you be willing to shave off your head? Or even worse, would you let an amateur like me shave off your head? <laughs> Here, take these down here as high as... <laughs> <laughs> Won't be needing those anymore for a while. Okay, smile at the camera and say you still wanted to do this. I still want to do this. Okay. She still wants to go out there, even though she had... I don't have anything yet. Okay. No, I don't think it looks too bad. Cool. I think you're very brave. I couldn't have done it. Okay. I am now picking up all the hair off the floor. For me and my child. <laughs> 